This is Tracy Hart with WYRE Radio, and I am so excited to be sitting here with Alexander Liff, who is the Special Events Committee Chair for the Annapolis Design District. Now, there is a wonderful event that's going to be happening here in just a few days on Thursday, April 10. It's Paint the Town Blue for Cystic Fibrosis. Alexander, thank you so much for being here with me today. Thanks. I'm happy to be here. Absolutely. Now, this is the second annual Paint the Town Blue for Cystic Fibrosis that the Annapolis Design District has sponsored. What made you guys decide to, to put together this type of an event? Well, this year I'm one of the 40 under 40 for cystic fibrosis. Last year we got involved because my father's on the board for cystic fibrosis here in Annapolis. And I've met a lot of people that have cystic fibrosis, a lot of people that are really involved in the chapter, and we wanted to do something that really could make a difference because 99 cents on the dollar goes to cystic fibrosis when you raise the money. So we really wanted to do something for that cause. Now last year you guys raised quite a bit of money for cystic fibrosis. Yeah, we raised almost $7,000 in just under three hours. So we're really excited to be doing it again. That's amazing. Now, this event is going on, as I mentioned, Thursday, April 10th, from 5 to 8 p.m. at the Maryland Paint and Decorating, which is right on 209 Chiquipin Round Road here in Annapolis. Now, talk about the actual event. What will be happening? What will be going on? What will people be seeing? Well, we're going to have a live band, and we're going to have a silent auction. We already have some really great items that have been donated. We've got a photography session, dinner for two, a personal chef, some really great things coming in. And we've got some local food, drinks, a lot of fun, even some bingo. So it's going to be a, a lot of fun mingling. We're going to have the design district members here and members of the community. So it's just going to be a, a lot of fun so now it's $15 for district members and $25 for non-district members. But as you mentioned, that goes to cystic fibrosis. Yes, all the proceeds of the night are going to go to the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. Okay, so for people out there who maybe aren't sure if they should come or not come, what would you want to say to them? It's going to be a really fun night. I mean, last year we had over 150 people come, so we were really, really surprised at the results, and we really want to even better the, the results this year. So, yeah, come on down, and it's going to be a fun night. There you go, folks. It's really important. Again, it's a wonderful organization, the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. They do a lot of wonderful things for the community, for the Annapolis area, and of course, just for, for people in general. Definitely want to support them. Again, the event's going to be, it's the second annual Paint the Town Blue for Cystic Fibrosis. It's sponsored by the Annapolis Design District. It'll be going on Thursday, April 10th from 5 to 8 p.m. And you're going to, there's going to be cocktails and local food, music and silent auction, all kinds of wonderful things. Again, it all goes to a wonderful cause. It will be at the Maryland Paint and Decorating, which is again at 209 Chinquapin Round Road, right here in Annapolis. It's very easy to get to, plenty of parking, so no worries there. Stop by, make it, you know, put it on your calendar after work, stop by, support a great cause, visit my friends here with the Annapolis Design District, and just really be part of the community. So, Alexander, where would people go to get more information about the event? AnnapolisDesignDistrict.com. We also have an Eventbrite page for Paint the Town Blue. There's a link to the Eventbrite page right on AnnapolisDesignDistrict.com if you want to buy tickets. There you go. Thank you so much, Alexander, for being here with me today. Thanks. Absolutely. I'm Tracy Hart with WYRE Radio.